Hello everybody, it's Taylor here, and if you look around me, you'll see you have a different background today. I'm actually filming this in my bedroom. I have a collective haul for you guys. Um, a few pieces from Nordstrom Drax, um, a few pieces from Playlist Closet Black Friday sale, and then some other pieces from this really great um, upscale resale shop for women. Um, it's run by a great woman and she also owns a playlist closet and she actually was nice enough to give me a job um, if you remember in my last outfit of the day it was for an interview and that was the interview that I went on and I got the job um, it's really great working there I've enjoyed it so far um, and because you know it's retail um, there are some perks unlike most retail stores like Forever 21 or H&M instead of getting a discount we get what is called an allowance every pay period so I think it's like 40 cents per hour that we work it gets set aside for like I guess you can call it like store credit so at each pay period you have like basically money free money to spend in the store so I got um, a lot of great things so I thought that I would show you um, these are things I've gotten and I've got 10 from um, November and December. Um, I think I will start off with accessories. Um, I'm going to try and go in order of when I when I got them. Um, I have these earrings. Try this one up close. These little earrings. They're really pretty. They're studs. Let's see. They're studs on the back, um, and they're really pretty. Um, they're gold and they have like crystals or diamonds or whatever in them. Um, and they're just really nice little. They are pretty heavy. And then when I looked, and you're probably not going to be able to see this here, probably not going to be able to catch. But I don't know if you can see that. It has the stamp on there that's the swan. And I looked at that and I'm like, this, these are Swarovski. So they're Swarovski crystals, I guess. But. I think I only, well, I really didn't pay anything for these. I guess I got these for free with my allowance. I think they were $8 or something like that. But they're really pretty, so I got those. Another piece of jewelry that I got going with that kind of golden sparkly theme was this ring. This was $8. Um, I bought this. I didn't get this with my allowance. I just bought this straight out. This is $8. Um, I love it because it kind of has, it's silver, camera going to focus, it's silver and gold, has little gold links there, and it has diamonds, it goes all the way around except for one spot, but it's really pretty. If you've seen this in an outfit post, I think, on my Twitter, not my Twitter, you've seen this before in like an outfit of the day video, um, that is not posted yet, but you'll see it, um, I like it. It's really nice. Just wear. I usually wear my middle finger, and it's just really nice. Um, the next piece of jewelry that I got was this awesome uh, gold chain choker. Um, it's really pretty. It has a toggle clasp, and this is very, like, very heavy gold. And if you follow me on Instagram. You've seen it a couple times, and if, for all my friends, I wear this to work, like, all the time. And this is only $10, but I got that with my allowance. Um, most recent pieces of accessories that I got were um, two more necklaces. This one was actually 50% off. I bought these just outright because they were really pretty. Um... And at my store, if you see something, you kind of have to get it because, you know, kind of like a thrift store, you know, or a Plato's Closet, things are one of a kind, and so you're not going to be able to usually find another piece like it. So when you see something, you have to get it. But this is a really cute um, kind of bar necklace that you've seen a lot of people. I know, like, Claire Marshall on Oh Hey Claire from YouTube and Anna Lee from Anna Lee and Jesse. Um, 
they have a few ones like this, but this one actually has like um diamonds on the inside. I don't know if you can see that. But it's a gold chain. And then when I looked at it, it was Leah Sophia, which is like one of those jewelry companies that you actually can have jewelry parties at your home and stuff, like, you know. They're uh, the catalog jewelry. Okay, the next accessory that I got, um, were the were as an amazing deal. These fry boots that were thirty six, but I used um, part of my discount, so I can't remember what they actually ended up coming out to be, like fifteen dollars or sixteen or something like that. Um, but there are these amazing fry boots. You can see, you know, the little fry thing there, or. You know, it has a fry label at the bottom. These are basically brand new when I got them. Um, and, um, except now they kind of look a little roughed up. The bottoms are dirty because I've been wearing them like crazy. Um, the reason I got them is because I needed a pair of warm, like, boots I can wear in the snow because it's been snowing like crazy and blizzarding and stuff like that. And I didn't have any boots that fit that were, you know, warm. And these have, like, I don't know if you can see. I can roll it down, like Sue says, to fry. But it has, like, all this fur. You see all this fur? This is, like, throughout the whole shoe. Like, you know how some shoes, they just have the fur on the top? Or it's just the top and not the bottom. There's fur all the way through to the toes in here. They're just amazing. And I had looked at them. I had tried them on. I was walking around the store, put them on hold, took them off of hold. It's like, I'm not sure because they're tan and tan is going to be hard to keep clean and, you know, I'm going to have to weatherize them. See, it's a little but These are really great. Um, they are a little bit clunky, though, with the heel. Like, I've worn these to work and after a while, because the heel is actually a bit high. Um, they're not as flat as my other flat boots that I have. So after a while, like, I can't wear them all day because they kind of hurt my feet after a while and kind of like bottom is really heavy. It's a little bit clunky but they definitely keep my feet warm so until I found a pair of black flat boots or brown boots these will do because they're amazing and they're fry. They're the first pair of fry boots that I've ever owned and if you know the fry company you know that their boots are made with the best leather they're made with the best quality um, these are our size 9 Usually in boots, I try to get either nine and a half or ten, so I can have room because I need to wear socks. So these were a good fit, good size. Um, okay, so the last piece that I got was from our Black Friday sale. Um, we had forty percent off bags, and I got this lovely um, bag here for eleven dollars. Um, what really drew me to it was just the pattern of it with this um, like a carpet bag, which reminded me of Julie Andrews and Sound of Music or Mary Poppins, like, I was like, oh, it's a cart bag, like, I'm just gonna pull a big old lamp <laughs> out of it or something, but I loved, um, the light cream, and I didn't have a bag like this, like, I really don't have a bag like this in my collection, it has these really nice soft leather pieces here, it has the gold, um, little studs on the, what is on my bag? I don't know what that is. I'll put it in something. I don't know. I'll fix it. I'll clean it. But it has this really nice soft gray leather. And it fits a lot. The only thing is that when it's here and I put all my stuff in it, it starts to get heavy because I can't really... I mean, I guess I could. But it's really great. Moving on to clothes. Trying to go in order of like what I bought first and then what I bought recently. This dress is really pretty. It is Ann Taylor Loft. Of course, it's a spring-summer dress. But it was discounted to $4 because there was like a spot or something on it that they didn't realize when they bought it there was a spot on it. Um, but when I took it home, I mean, you just wash it and it came right out. Like I put like a little spot treatment on it, but it came right out. And it's just really pretty, like magenta, not magenta, like a fuchsia type pink purple. I love the ruffle. It's really nice cinched in elastic waist. And the back looks like that. So I thought this would be a cute dress to wear when we, um, <coughs> my husband and I go um, to Canada next year for our anniversary. So I thought that was nice. 
and really cute and a great deal. Um, I also got this skirt. Um, just been looking for skirts um, in different like prints and patterns and things like that. But this one is really nice because I whole snake skin trend. And it's like this really pretty white and gray, light gray and dark gray um, snake skin. And has little pockets in the front here. Um, it's in the back and has like a little split right there. It's um, New York and Company. Let's see there, it's New York and Company, and I think this was ten dollars or twelve dollars, something like that. So I got that. Um, this next item was also on clearance. Um, this is this really nice blazer. I cuffed up the sleeves because it's just how I like to wear my blazers. It's put the sleeves down. It's just like that. So I just it was only folded up once. But it has this nice silky <coughs> light brown beige on the inside. Um it's just it doesn't have any closures or anything like that. It's just kind of a throw over oversized blazer. It's a size medium. It's from the brand Silence and Noise, which is, um, <laughs> I believe is sold at Urban Outfitters. It's either Urban Outfitters or Anthropology, but it was really cute. It was on sale. I think it was 50% off. These are Simply Vera, Vera Wang label there. They're these awesome like riding pants. So it's like um it's thicker than a legging but it has this nice elastic waist on the front and has all these great seamings stitches, seams down the front and on the back. It probably doesn't look like much of anything right now. But these are really nice and they kind of taper down at the bottom. They're so so comfortable. They feel like a sweatpant or pajamas and it's like it looks it feels super casual but it doesn't look too casual. Like I've worn this with a nice silk button up and a nice little cardigan and looked really professional. So I'm gonna wear it work. And these were seventeen it was sixteen dollars. Next pair of pants, um the next two items I recently got um, the same time as I got the beanie and the Vince Camuto bracelet. I got this um, Sunday. Um, I remember when we first got these in. These are RDI. They're RDI. They're like, um, I wouldn't say a legging because they're thicker than leggings, but they're like casual pants, kind of like a lady and what I love is they have this faux leather or this leather stripe down the middle. And it's let me see if I can show you. It's fairly wide. It's a fairly wide um leather stripe down the middle. So it's kinda of like that tuxedo look and with the leather and I've been looking for ones like these that weren't like, you know, a hundred dollars or more. But these were only sixteen dollars and I got them with my allowance and these are super cute they have that kind of edgy look to it with the leather but I mean it's so comfortable like they fit like a glove and I was really excited to see their size medium and those are really great I was looking for them when we first got them and I couldn't find them and then just so happened that I was looking through the jeans and they were there so I was like I need these but these don't hold for me I'm going to get them the next piece I got um it's going to be hard to see you probably aren't even going to be able to see this it's this really pretty um really maybe I'll put it over here you can see it's this really beautiful um white blazer um, it's all the way buttoned up now, but it has snaps, so you can like unsnap it, and it can be like fold over, and it has like this really pretty like structured kind of peplum in the front and the back. 
it also has like a different material right here. It has these really nice seams, and it kind of reminds me of that. You know how they had that neo that neoprene type of like scuba stuff, but it's it's really not. I mean, it's just polyester, but it feels like that scuba material. And this is super chic, super stylish, and I think it was only fifteen or sixteen dollars. It's Lab Works, um, which I'm not really familiar with the brand, but it's super cute. I mean, it has all these snaps, so you can wear it all the way snapped up. You can wear it, you know, flaps open. You can wear it, you know, open a little more. You can wear it with it completely open. It's super cute. I said that too many times already, but it's really chic. It just, you know, when I wear this, I would definitely have that Olivia Pope moment. Like, this is something that I think she would definitely wear on the show. It would look really cute with the snake skin see that the snake skin skirt and that'd be like really cute <laughs> it would look very nice very elegant put together very you know business appropriate you could wear that to the office I mean my you know dress code is pretty casual but I um, I could dress a little you know professional from now and then put together um, but yeah, so I was really happy when I got this. I did, it did have shoulder pads in it, which I took those out, and I did take it in on the sides a little bit, because it's a medium, but it was fitting just a tiny bit big in the waist area, like it still looked nice, but, you know, I just wanted to make sure that it had the perfect fit. So I got that. Um, so this shirt that I got from Nordstrom Rack, it's really cute, it has these great cutouts, um, that on like the arm part which is kind of weird because if you don't wear it right then it's like where your armpit is but I guess I mean it kept me cool in the concert when it was hot it's like I got to fan my pits out I guess <laughs> but it's really nice and it's a little bit cropped um with it um the next top was gorgeous cheetah print um what is it Daniel Rain Daniel Rain Oh, this top was 19 I think it was on sale, I think it was $19. This was on sale, it was $10, so I was like, $10, I get it, I mean, it's still cute. It has this weird, like, collar thing, like, the collar's just kind of, like, just flow over, and it's a little blousey, I mean, it's not fitted, it's kind of loop, like, oversized, it's a size medium. And it's really pretty cheetah print, very sheer chiffon in the back, it's just, as you can see, you can see the hanger through it, so it's like sheer, black on the back, got this amazing print on the front, and I wore this with, the other day to work, you've probably seen it on my Instagram, if you follow me, not that you have to, because, I mean, you know, it's just me, I wore it with my orange necklace, wrapped around twice and then I wore my tan blazer over top of it and it looked really good. This will look great with my uh, leather, my pants with the leather on it as well. Does that look really bad? I'm sorry. Yeah, so that was only ten dollars and it looked really good under this other jacket I was trying well it was a full other jacket that I was trying on that was really cute so I was like I figured I'd get it <laughs> excuse me so I found tops so I found a top for the concert and I was still looking for everything else bottoms and a, I really wanted a moto jacket like I really am still looking for a moto jacket a nice leather one they had some there but they're like <laughs> hundred plus dollars I'm not ready to make that big of an investment yet um, there was one at my store that was only forty six dollars but someone else bought it and I was really heartbroken and sad but I found this at Plato's Closet on their Black Friday sale I think it was forty percent off and then I got an extra five dollars off my whole entire purchase it was only 
14, 16, something like that. It wasn't that much. Like, under $20. And it's this really cool, like, bluish gray, um, leather jacket. The only thing I didn't, I wasn't crazy about this thing. Like, when it, neck part, but it has zippers here, has zippers there, and they actually do work. It has a hidden pocket on the inside, has pockets down here, has this little loop for a belt, but didn't come with a belt. Had really nice, um, stitches on the sleeve. I just like the stitching of it. And it was really inexpensive, so. And it was on sale. I was like, that would look nice. So I wore this on top of this, and I paired with it my gold chain choker. And it looks great. It looks, it looks really good. And for bottoms, I got these, you're gonna, <clears throat> you're probably gonna flip out, because I've looked out. These are American Apparel, $15, Playoffs Closet, Black Friday. And they're just like the easy jeans, I guess. They're high-waisted. Um, they got the simple, like, pockets, kind of like the disco pants do. And they're just this beautiful, beautiful wash. Look at the pants. Looking for my size, because these are size medium. And I'm looking like, you know, the five, because it's junior size. So I'm looking through the five, you know, mediums. And I was like, saw the American Apparel, and I'm like, American Apparel that I looked at, and I'm like, these look really big. And so I put it back on the rack. I start looking and pulling a bunch of other jeans out, and I'm like, well, if I'm going to try the other ones on, I might as well try these on. Went to the dress room. There was a line, and I was about to be late for work, but, you know, I had called them, even though she sent me over there, and it was right next door. I was like, I'll be right over once I'm done. So I tried them on. You know, I was just slipping pants on, they didn't fit, threw them off, flip another pair on, they didn't fit. Flip these on, it was like, zip them up, it was like, oh, it like fit perfectly. Zip them up, fit perfectly. They're great. And they're so, they have like that stretch to it. They feel almost like a legging. So I guess you could say they're like a jegging. I mean, they have the look of, sorry, my nose. They have the look of jean but they feel like leggings and they are amazing and I wear them definitely could, could definitely wear them with anything that is cropped so I wore it of course again I keep telling everyone I wore it with this top and it looked great because it's not like crop cropped but it's not like super long and so with the high waisted jeans you know make sure nothing was like falling out or hanging out and it's great, you bend over it and your booty crack's not gonna show. And these are fifteen dollars and I was just like the only other American Apparel thing I own is this shirt. And this I got second hand too, so <laughs> yeah. So now I have two American Apparel things. The last thing I got still has the tags on it because it's a spring skirt. Um it's actually from Rue Twenty One. It still has the tag on it and they it was Clarence when the person got it. I guess it was $44 and then it was $21.99 and then they have bought it for $16.99 but I only paid $8 and it's this really pretty white elastic waist um it's lace if you could tell that it's lace um and it's a maxi skirt look at that it goes all the way down all the way down and it's I've been looking for a white skirt for ages I've been looking for a white blazer for ages and finally found a nice one you know and it's a maxi skirt and it's light and airy and I think the whole white on white trend is really cool so maybe I'll wear my white blazer with it or just you know nice little top can't wait to wear this in the spring it has little loops for like belt so I'm just noticing. But I have some nice, I think white and tan or beige look really nice together. So I have a lot of my skinny, oh my braided belt. Really nice um, skinny belts that would look cute with that. Well, this is all I have for you guys. I hope I wasn't out of frame the whole time. But that's, well that's all I have for my haul. Um... Leave a comment below if you would like to see me style any other pieces. I do want to do a lookbook um, 
pretty soon coming up so hopefully I'll be able to you know film that and get that out to you guys but I just want to say thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe down there because you know it's free and it really would make my day so just please subscribe um, and thumbs up this video and I do have more videos to come I have ones that I still have to edit I have some DIYs coming up so stay tuned for those um, you can follow me on Instagram, um, BuckeyeBeauty05, or you can like my, uh, Facebook page for my jewelry line, um, Lemon Cove, at Lemon Cove Jewel over here, um, also have a Facebook for my jewelry line, um, Lemon Cove Fashion Jewelry, and that's about it. So I hope you guys are all having a great day and I'll see you next time.